Hello, dear viewers. Welcome back to more Madness Project Nexus. We're gonna go through the Nexus Core facility using only guns, which will be fun because guns. And they have shields, so we need to look out for that. But how are you doing today? I am doing fine. And, while I think of it, there's this game called Elden Ring coming out. Odds are, I'll be playing that. Would any of you be willing to watch me play that? Leave your comments below telling me if you want to see me play Elden Ring. Because I read all of your comments. All of them. I'm not joking. I, I, re I see every one of them. Even when you think you can, uh, you know, edit them to say something else. I, I know what the original said. Uh, yeah. Yep. You can't, you can't hide from me. Okay, I don't know what the original says. If you edit it before I see it... You know what? That's besides the point. There goes all the stuff. Oh god. Here, while I remember. Because I can't turn off the ambient music in the, the mission separately from the lobby area. I'll turn this off and uh, I'll play some like killing floor music. Man, it's great being able to tear through these guys. Oh, look at that! You have a tack bar and you're gonna dodge my stuff? I don't think so. This guy keeps hitting me though. He needs to stop that. Ah! Uh. Ooh! Wow, he sh he took a shot there. That dude had some health. So Elden Ring, I guess I'll talk about that since that's the hot topic, right? It's coming out. Actually, it's already kind of out. So I'll probably be playing it by the time you see this. It comes out in like 12 hours or something. So I figured I'd pre-record this now while I have a chance. Oh my god. Ethan, please. Like, Ethan just dropkicked that man. Ethan's the only one that hasn't, like, taken a beating, too. What happened to all your health bars, guys? Oh, get in the elevator. Come on. I'm covered in melted cheese. Get in the elevator. Oh, a side note. I've swapped my eye bandage for the ammo backpack. So, less accuracy, but more ammo. I, I guess that's a good trade-off, right? Elden Ring is supposed to be like Dark Souls. I, uh, never really was a fan of Dark Souls. I don't know who all's here. So we're just gonna spray and pray. Quite literally. Someone's gonna shoot me. Someone missed. You fools. Those guys didn't miss, though. Ow, my health bar. These guys keep shooting me. Man, Ethan just really wants his freaking kid back, dude. Like, he just suplexed a man. Bruh. Morris can't keep up. Granted, Morris has gone into dodging rather than attacking this time. A good survival strategy, I guess, but, you know, considering Taters has more health than him, I'd say he's doing better. You know, a good offense is a good defense, right? You can't get hurt by your enemy if you kill them before they hurt you. These guys enjoy headshots, huh? Seeing the amount of times they take them before dying. We're almost out of ammo. And it's the final area. So, bullpup time. Wait, no, this is... What is it? What... What is this what it's a FAMAS, yes I know, it's not a bullpup, but it's a type of weapon that the that the bullpup is. Like assault rifle, something along the lines of that. Alright, now we know that we have to tell them. Actually, all of you go over there, thank you. Morris, come grab the health. Yeah, there we go. Now taters, you go over here. You just gotta figure out there it is. At the very bottom, and it works. All of you go over there. Let's go. Elden Ring is like Dark Souls. Right, right, right. Before I lose, before I lose focus. I already lost focus. I'm sorry. All right, it's like Dark Souls, and I played the first Dark Souls. I beat Orstein and Smog. It was never fun to me. Like, 
a little bit like the beginning of the game was like, oh man, yeah. And then like having to kill the enemies every time, that got boring fast. You know, maybe it's because I didn't know what I was doing. And the whole game of Dark Souls is designed around Grillmaster's almost dead. I don't know how. I don't, I don't actually know where he is either. He is dead. Where did he go? He got eaten alive. Well, that's le this level is tough for you. Well, these guys would be toast if this is madness. Just having fun with the full auto that I can have. Oh, look! I get his gun, though! Yeah, so I just didn't really like Dark Souls. I, I found it boring. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We don't have any piercing. I totally forgot about these guys. That poor man. Did you see him just sitting there dodging? Huh. We're out of ammo. Switching to the other gun. Is he dead? Oh, he's dead. Sorry, Grill Master. I'm taking your energy shotgun. All things considered, I'll probably swap you to that. Sorry, pal. Well, we know Grill Master can't survive. Did anyone else level up, though? Ethan leveled up. Ethan suplexed a man and got a level. Whereas Grill Master went down fighting and <laughs> got sent to the obituaries. Oh, <laughs> well, yeah, I can upgrade. Well, why, why do I even bother upgrading that? You know? Because this is the last mission they can go on. There's Grillmaster. Here we go. We're gonna unequip that, unequip that, equip that, and then give that your back weapon. Uh, maybe one second thought. We'll just take this from you and give you another shotgun. There we go. He should be fine now. Or he'll die again. I don't know. I mean, he's a hunter, but it looks like he got hunted. Oh! I'm probably going to be playing Elden Ring with a keyboard and mouse. Because we, we all know that the developers of Dark Soul... It, it's from software, which is... Kind of a weird name. Goodbye, traffic cones. I hardly knew ye. Oh, look! They survived! Oh! Oh, never mind. I guess I just kicked them off myself. Money that I don't need. Shot me. Wait, I lost I lost focus. I got distracted by the traffic cones vanishing. Uh Elden Ring from software. Something about from software. Guys over here. Let them come to us. Let them come to us! This is going to be D-Day for them. I have a machine gun. Hey, come on now. Hey, look at this. Hey, guys, seriously. Let them attack us. <laughs> Whatever. Now, seriously, I do not rem remember what I was going to say about why I brought up specifically from software. Oh, God. You're like, ah, you were saying this, and then my focus immediately went, traffic codes go boom. You know? Like any intelligent individual, I guess. Just kidding, I'm not intelligent. Or maybe I am, it's just I have so many handicaps with my mental status that I just seem like below average. I don't know. It's apparent that I have ADHD at this point. <laughs> ow. 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 Stop. Ow. Ow. Dude was just whipping me with a police baton. Uh-oh. Big boy. And he smashes him. Hey, guys. Look who has infinite ammo now. Oh, 
That's some nice tack bar you have there. Oh hey, the infinite ammo wore off. I'm so sorry. I feel like Maghang from episode the Madness Combat 10, where he just like cuts everyone in half. That's so fun. Imagine if Prinkles let you play as Lobster Hank. I'm gonna kill this guy. Yeah. I put no points into strength and I just crushed that dude's head, but I can't hold like two submachine guns in one hand each. Kinda sad. Look, Grillmaster, you're doing so much better now. Taters and Ethan, you know? What are you, what are you guys doing? Excuse me, pardon me. We're here to see the director. There. Now, Ethan, you need to go heal up. Just, just pour some of your, like, healing juice over your wounds. I'm sure that's fine. You know, you know exactly what I'm talking about, too. Um, you know what? I think... I think it's time to crash some parties. Oh. Oh god, I didn't realize how much ammo I had. Look at all of the reloads I have with this. It doesn't matter how accurate I am because I can just fire so many bullets I won't need to worry about hitting my target. Hey! I, I don't mean to scare you, but today's forecast is bullets. I just, just, you know, just a hunch. Just a hunch. Oh my god. I am slower than dirt. But on the bright side, I don't need to move very much as long as everything melts before me. I keep forgetting the big guys. You know... I'll buy a sniper rifle and see how that goes next time. S seriously, Ethan, Tater, guys, come on. Guys, don't get grabs. Rip his helmet off, boys. Rip it. Oh, God. You know what? Here's something that's cool. While I'm busy frying my freaking sound card... There we go. Well, I'm frying my sound card with that. You guys can still hear the music. Because it's edited in later. I have no idea what music is playing right now. It could be the uh, Dead Rising Mall music for all I know. Taters is like missing most of his health. So let's give him... All of you guys got to go over here first. Pick up the health. Pick up the health, buddy. There you go. There. Yeah, he'll survive. Excuse me, your free trial of being alive is over. Sorry to say, none of you can live. Oh, God. Well. You know, I don't need that. I might not be able to get it in time. I got it. Well, it's all over. Like, I'm the heavy weapons guy, and all of you are my targets. <laughs> I got given the Kritzkrieg. That's what triple damage is, is the Kritzkrieg from Team Fortress 2. Uh. I was gonna, like, say, oh man, what kind of character should I play in Elden Ring? But you, the game will already be out, and I'll probably already be playing it by the time you guys see this. I'll probably end up streaming it, too. That'll be weird. I don't know how I'll go about that. Like, I guess I could divvy up the stream into, like, episodes. Oh, God, another one. Of course, it hasn't even taken any damage yet. I mean, it looks like he's about to be. I mean, Taters is about to go down, too. He doesn't know the meaning of step the hell back. 
So let's get him over here and go go over there, buddy. You can still live. Stop hitting my friend. Oh, let me reload. There's going to be so many holes in you, you'll be Swiss cheese. Wait, who dropped this gun? Who dropped this PKN? A Russian assault rifle. I think it's a Russian assault rifle. Oh, looky! Real master, no, don't be a hero. Taters also don't be a hero. Ethan? Ethan, man, that's not how you fight things. Yeah, you guys need to hit it multiple times. There you go. Don't let him grab you. Just get his helmet off. Real master! Jesus, dude! I told you to take cover! Yeah. I can't hear you over the sound of my... Well, I can't hear you at all, period. Because... <laughs> my sound card, I guess, is being fried from all the bullets, but... You know how it goes. This is going very well. We had no casualties that time. However, no one leveled up. Actually, I think I know why no one leveled up. Just gonna take a trip over to the dormitory. Number one, see if there's any cool toys. Laser carbine. No, no, they're maxed. Level 30 is max. They just aren't leveling up because I am murdering literally everyone. That's the case. Let's buy a sniper rifle. Let's see where they are. I think this is the best one. It has 110 piercing. Look, these weapons all have like a oh, 5 piercing and all that stuff. Oh! I thought I saw a 6 in there somewhere. Oh, lordy, lordy. We're just gonna go with uh, 110 uh, piercing right there. I mean, this one has 65, but, you know, this one has more. Then we need to equip it, because, God forbid, being able to modify any weapon in your inventory. Then we'll probably want to make the barrel shorter. You know? No, that's a... <laughs> that's a weird gun. Uh, it looks like a VTS, right? We don't want it to have super... Law. <laughs> it's got a grip now. <laughs> Not like your character would use it. Uh, we want a short barrel. Like that. And then... We'll swap the sight with, I guess, the red dot. It still does a lot of damage, a lot of piercing, doesn't it? Yeah. It only does a 48 damage. Let's throw some stupid ammo in here. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Look at this! <laughs> There we go, it does more damage, has even less recovery, is loud as all hell, double the <laughs> magazine capacity, and an extra 40 piercing. So now this weapon does 150 piercing and 80 damage! <laughs> oh look, you can see the little thing in the middle of the gun there. Uh, yeah. The stock. Oh, this is- this is already the best stock we can get. Oh, we'll put a barrel core on it. No, we can't. We can't really mod this thing beyond this. I mean, does recovery really matter? I don't think I can fire it enough for recovery to matter. So now we have this on top of our... Uh... What should we call it? Whatever weapon we're gonna bring in here. I don't think the- I, I think we'll go in with the minigun first. Right? And then we'll swap out to... Whatever. We'll just go in with a bunch of heavy machinery. Heavy weapons, let's go, boys. I wish I could do something for Morris. It'd be cool if we could send them on missions on their own, kind of like the Palicos from Monster Hunter. Goodbye, traffic cones. Street barriers. Get out of here. 
I think it has something to do with the modifications on weapons. Oh, you guys get over here. Because I've noticed that my weapons, whenever I mod them at the base, the trash can goes wild. Oh, lucky. Listen, I don't know who's over there. All I know is that you're, you're not going to be over there very long. You guys ask for bullets? Listen, mail order bullets, okay? I got as many as y'all need. But more than you need. I can supply all of you. Okay, listen, the bullets are slightly used. Covered in some blood, too. But that's okay. You know what? You just get them involved. I'm sure that'll be fine for you guys, right? You just, you just need bullets. Hold on, I'm reloading. I just destroyed his shield and his helmet one shot. Let him get back up and then blew his head off. <laughs> uh, only in Madness Project Nexus. Seriously, this game. Like, they went, like, mwah with this game and its design. I love all of it so much. Like, it even rewards gameplay. Like, the fact that you gain health quicker if you're damaging enemies. You get your attack bar back for killing enemies. Stuff like that encourages, you know, doing what the game is meant for. Kind of like Bloodborne. In Bloodborne, where you like lose health when you get hit, but you gain it back if you deal damage. So it rewards you for being aggressive and, you know, getting into the fight or whatever. Whereas, you know, Dark Souls is like, no, stay back and wait for an opening. And it's just kind of like you sit there and you wait for them to do a certain attack so you know you can hit them, otherwise, you don't have enough time because of their animation and all that. I never played Bloodborne because it was on PC. No, it's on PS4. Or PlayStation. Just in general, PlayStation. So, you know, I never got to play it. Like, PlayStation was the only thing I never owned. I can't shoot that man in the head because he's behind cover. I can shoot all these guys. Does triple damage apply to my bullets hitting an enemy shield? I hope so. Here, enjoy this SMG. Fine, I'll go back to the assault rifle. You guys didn't enjoy the SMG. How are you? How are all of you doing? Oh, did you? You guys are doing even better now, somehow. Wrong side. Oh, God. Oh, this is out of ammo. Ow. Okay. Real master, no! Ah, these guys come out earlier. So I'm gonna get his shield off. Real master, no! Don't be a hero. Ethan is getting mauled there. Oh, Morris got the shield off anyway. Just shoot him in the head, guys. Just shoot him in the head. No, that's not good at all, sir. Why do all of you refuse to shoot them in the head? Like, Grill Master, come on. Oh, yeah, we need to mash enter to get through all that. I wish there was just an option. Okay, Monster Train has this option to make, like, all of the animations and whatnot go by just like, boop, 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 real quick. Like, I appreciate that after putting in, like, 300 hours into that game on the Switch. I very much appreciate that. We're gonna pull out our Super Sniper here. Look, I'm using a Super Soaker from Nerf! Why are you all dying? Drill Master, come on, buddy. There you go. It's so much easier if it would, like, highlight. You know, like, if I mouse over, like, if I hold Q and mouse over this gun, it shows me at the bottom of my screen I'm going to pick up that gun. You know? Or the fire extinguisher. Like, I click on it, and I... 
Well, you know, you gotta have no hand, nothing in your hands. But you, but you get my point. It highlights it, so I know what I'm interacting with. Uh, that dude was trying to snap his own neck. So, why can't it highlight the medical stuff when I tell these guys? But why can't I just control them? You know, that'd be nice. Can I get the- Ooh! Everybody's going to be waxed now. Because I'm a microwave. Sorry, boys. Let's keep on coming. Where's the... Oh, damn! I missed that shot. Oh, it's like bowling! Oh, good God! Seriously, it doesn't go... Okay, you would think a tank rifle would go through this dude's shield. It's meant to pierce through tanks! I'm sorry, Mr. Ninja. Listen, if Jeeves, if Jebediah can use a minigun at the end of his incident, I can use one whenever. Ow, ninja, ninja, ninja. Ah, oh, ninja, ninja in the cockpit, ninja in the cockpit. Another ninja. Dude, he got dizzy so, he got bodied. Guys, ninja, ninja, thank you, Grill Master. Master Meath and just kind of wombo comboed him. I don't know who's up there, but you're not going to be up there for long. Oh god. I think that actually deals damage to him. That goes through the helmet. I don't think I need this much piercing. Oh, his helmet's off now. And now his life is off. Nice shield, nerd. What? Seriously? What? <laughs> Why did you walk all the way up there? Buddy. Alright, I'm dropping that. I can move faster without it. I don't think anything is going to beat the AMR from Killing Floor 2. And I just put a pole through his head. Uh, it sucks that all these guns, like, you know, mine, and then this one I picked up, sound the same. Like, you know what? Yeah, I get it. You can only have so many... I guess you can only have so many sound effects in the game. But, you know... I like some, like, heavy. Like, it's already heavy. And if it was deeper, and, I don't know, bounces around the environment more, like, BOOM! Instead of BANG! You know? Does that make sense? I'll take this energy shotgun, man. And, uh... I'll take this weapon. Excuse me, pardon me. No one is missing health except for me! A resounding success. Hello. Excuse me? Pardon me. Nope, get out of my face. Grill Master, what are you- Grill Master is taking his name literally and getting all up in their grill. Alright. Guys, I want all of you up here. I mean, you aren't the shotgun squad that wrecks house, so... They're probably not going to be as effective up there. Suck it, nerd. You just kicked someone so hard they died. Ooh, lucky! 
So many power-ups, it must be my birthday. And look, duration refresh on those power-ups. I'm going to make all of you suffer. Now, I'm not going to be using that weapon too much. Because, you know, no fun. Get, get off of me. No, I want the infinite ammo! Alright, fine, I'll move. There. Jeez, guys. I need to do everything. Like, all of you were focusing on the big guy. None of you were focusing on the little guys. You gotta focus on the ads, man. If you've never played... If, like, you've never been in a dungeon before... Come on. I was gonna say, never played World of Warcraft, but, like, every other game like that, too. Like, any... any MMO. doesn't actually hit, even have to be an MMO. Someone get his shield. Someone get his stuff. Get his stuff. Get his helmet. Morris, come on, man. You know better. Fine, I'll get his helmet off. Whoops, I hit Cat's Lock. I didn't mean to hit that. And now he doesn't exist anymore. Is he still alive? Oh god, he's still alive. There we go. Now he's not. Uh, I don't want this weapon. I want the sniper rifle. Here we go. There we go. Now that man is no more. His head is three different parts on a different continent. Hey guys, what are you doing over here? It's just like playing sharpshooter in, what, Killing Floor 2. You just pick up a really big gun and make enemies stop existing. This grill master. He got grilled. Uh, I'm going to pick up his shotgun because I don't think there's any other weapon I can use. That's a lie. I think I very specifically did not use the... Yeah, here it is. The N60. <laughs> get it. Excuse me. Alright, Ethan and Taters, each, each you guys get one. You know what? I'll mention it now. Have I mentioned how cool Lord Shen from Kung Fu Panda 2 is? I just, I just need to make sure you all know that. Hello! This is my base now. Like, seriously. Why can't I just, you know, summon my minions and take this place over? You know? Like, look, we'll just take this base. Look at all this technology we could have. It's an entire headquarters. Who's gonna stop me? Hmm, right, right. I want everyone over here. No, over here. Don't... You you can kill that guy, but I want it to be over here when you kill him. There we go. My my little friends aren't uh, aren't cooperating. Yeah, see, they we'll just get killed. I'm too close to hit people with this machine gun. You think the barrel being in their mouth would help? But nah. I'll just pick up some shotguns on the ground. There's another one around here. Hold on. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Can I have that? I might. Whoops. Hold on. There we go. Can I just, like, have your shotgun? Thanks. No, no, I'm... I want yours. 
Oh, his is out of ammo. This one isn't, though. Stop hiding behind your shields, losers. Hmm. That did not solve the problem I had. Still not solving the problem I had. Good old Buckshot solves every problem. Excuse me, pardon me. Oh, I'm stuck on an invisible wall. I'm just gonna murder that guy real quick with an impressive feat of strength. Get out of my face. Damn ninjas. You can never prove the absence of ninjas, just the direct presence. Morris is over here taking down one of these guys himself. He's just freaking repeatedly dodging it. Ow, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to bring attention to your fa failings. Ethan is dead. Morris, buddy. Stop hiding behind. Oh no, Morris took some damage. Oh, uh, another gun. I need another gun. This one. There we go. I got my gun back. That's one of them dead. Yeah. You want to dodge my shots? I'll just keep shooting. Oh, look! This is a, what I call a death laser. It might not be an actual laser, but damn! Anyone on the receiving end doesn't care! Look at N60 that's randomly been modded. Whoops, I just took a dude's head off and I wasn't even aiming at him. Well, you know what they say, when you're given a minigun, ah, I've been flashbangs. Yes, that's the saying, when you when you have a minigun, you usually just be flashbanged, and that'll be the end of you. Hey, can you, like, put that shield down? There we go. He didn't want to listen at first, you know, he was having some difficulty hearing me. It's like shooting barrels in a barrel! I think I dropped the wrong weapon somewhere. Yeah, this is my N N60. Where's, uh... Ow. Where's my, uh, scar? There it is. The scar of death. I actually picked up theirs and I didn't even notice. Whoops. I didn't mean to shoot the money out of that dude's mouth. I'm literally putting money where their mouths are, huh? Hmm. I guess with this, we are also approaching the end of the ranged only playthrough. Of course. Stop with the shield. Can I? Wait. You can just wedge weapons and walls like that. Okay. Who's up here? There's no one up there anymore. Now who's over here? This one dude. He's like... He was traumatized in the corner and I got near him. He's like, oh man, this guy has a gun that can vaporize everyone. Oh, I'm gonna run at him with a stun stick. Like, dude. Dude, no, don't do it. I mean, I'm kind of freaking covered in melted cheese, but still. Arena victory. I gave him a chance to live, but he's like, no, nah, I need to go get the cheese, man, because that's what I look like. I am a freak. <laughs> man wrapped <in> Gorgonzola. <laughs> Or honey. I guess it could be covered in honey, too. I don't know. It looks like fondue-type cheese. The, the, the cheese... the cheese whip, or whatever it is. 
We got a phone call. I'm gonna put the minigun down so I can move at a reasonable speed. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, here, I discovered this as well. Here's a bonus thing that you can do. Right? Pay attention to the top. I just killed someone. And now if we look down here... There's just bits of blood. There's one other person you can kill. You know, besides yourself. There it is. I don't think you can really see. Yeah, it's just another dead person down there. I have no idea which of these guys can and can't be killed. I just know that I've killed them. Multiple times. Mm -hmm. He agrees. Okay. Now then, I want to check how long it's been. Now, it's been about 40 minutes. Yeah, we'll end it here. But first, we should read this. Is it time? Yeah, send me the address. I'll be right over. Okay. So now that we've told Boss Man that we're ready, I could buy a PKN. I mean, I may as well, right? We've told Boss Man we can finally finish the tutorial. What can I put on a PKN, though, is the question. I'm gonna slap that accuracy up. We'll put a shotgun barrel on it. Who knows? Might come in handy. Is there a PKN long barrel? It's just a normal one. Yeah, look at that. Mmm, delicious, delicious violence. And then we could just get this. Boom. Look at that. Wow, look! A hundred bullets instead of seventy-five! The only difference is five less recovery. Yeah, buddy! Listen, who needs to reload? Apparently I don't, because I don't have time for that crap with how fast I reload. Now, I'm going to tell you right now, I have I play Starbound when I have, like, ten minutes or so to do stuff in. Just like, oh, I have, like, fifteen minutes before work. I guess I could play Starbound and, like, you know, go rob my NPCs, I guess, because they're going to pay me in bandages anyway. So I hold control. You can see the, the crosshair changes when I press the button here. <laughs> I keep pressing it to try and move my camera to see better, because you can do that. <laughs> But, you know, I end up telling my guys to go somewhere else. <laughs> yes. I love physics like this. I like the Blender Man in Dying Light, too. Uh, oh, that's a good one. I'm just, like, stabbing a decoy. Oh, <laughs> uh, this is awkward without audio. There we go. Yes. I just wish we'd get like a hit marker up top where it's like hit, 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 and then, you know, kill or whatever. I guess it doesn't matter. So this is where we're gonna end it. And then next time... Next episode will be the final episode of the ranged only challenge, and then I guess I'll see if I can play through the game without buying anything. Or without spending money, specifically. Because, as you know, I can be cheap. Absolutely. I mean, if you watch me play Halo 2 on Legendary, yes, you'll know that I just spam the uh, noob combo. Look, we can get goth. Which, I don't know why you would need to buy that. You end up with, like, I don't know, every other cosmetic in the game being non, you know, colorable, and they're black and white and gray anyway. 
since that the mo most of the madness world is black and gray it's a pretty much a grayscale actually well we got one left let's buy casino we're also on our way to buying all these I'm so glad they made those permanently unlock like that was a much needed change now if only you know we could color half the like end game stuff and I guess that's for, you know, next update. Crinkle's working on his animation right now. So we're gonna go head over to this trash can. Slap it for being a bad boy. Slap this one for falling over next to us. And I guess I'll just hop on the... Oh, excuse me, sir. Am I interrupting your leisurely stroll through the rain? I can't... I can't stand on the... bus stop, so I guess I'll just stand awkwardly in front of it and tell you that I, th I thank you for watching. So, thank you for watching. Don't forget, uh, say stuff about Elden Ring, what, like, what you want me to do with that. Seriously, I'll do stuff with Elden Ring, even if I didn't like Dark Souls. I want to try out Elden Ring. So, thanks a lot for watching. I hope you have a good rest of your day, and take care. I'll see you next time.